All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is good? Your boy Game Day J in the mix. Um, dang, what am I doing today? I'm trying out this Blackwater Maiden um, Fatal Frame game. That's a well, it's basically a demo, but it's free to play. Uh, I put this in 1080p. Um, so and it's at the highest setting for the highest everything. So I don't know if this is gonna stutter or whatever, but this is just a test. So you can buy the full game. It's on the Nintendo Wii U. Uh, let's go into options. I might have subtitles or something like that. General settings, camera control, rumble on, search mode. Okay, we don't need to mess with these. Camera sensitivity, we'll leave them right there until I figure out that's too slow. Subtitles are on. The brightness, let's see what the brightness is. Set the set the brightness so that you can see the ghost face on, on the end of the arrow. Oh, shit. Now, I actually have my... I actually have my... Um, TV and game mode, so it's pretty dark. Like right here, I can see the ghost because I know the ghost is there, but right here is even better. All this other stuff is too blur, it's too. I think this is good. Either this one or this one. Shit. Let's go with this one just so I can see a little bit more. English, and we'll go ahead and back out. And we'll go ahead and back out, and we'll start the trial. New game. So you can play the first couple of minutes. This game is a work of fiction. Any resemblance to actual people or organizations in coincidental or incidental? Coincidence. One such girl is Mi Miyu. I'm just gonna say her first name. If that's even how you say that. She awakens to find herself in an old half-blooded building. So this game's kind of motion controlled and it's perfect for the Nintendo Wii U. And I thought I'd come in here and test it out with the with the HD settings, because like I said, I have it on 1080p. I don't think I've ever tried to do anything on 1080p with the resolution or the the little meter. You know how like people that own an Elgato know what I'm talking about. It goes good, better, and it goes best. I have it all the way on best, so it's doing like it might not write well or something. I have no clue. Trying to see how lovely I've seen this game being played a little bit, and it looked really gorgeous. So let me know in the comments below how you guys feel about it. Damn, this tea, it's fucking dark as fuck on here. Maybe I should turn off game mode since this game is not actually... Woo! Since this game is not actually like a first-person shooter. We'll see. We'll see. I might need to just turn the, bo the brightness up. Where am I, she says. Am I able to move yet? Nope, I'm not. What t-shirt contest? I win. She wins. We all win. So I never played any of the Fatal Frame games. I've always seen them being played. And I was like, yo, that looks kind of interesting. It reminds me of Silent Hill. And I like Silent Hill. I'm not the biggest fan, but I like Silent Hill. So why not have it where you got to use these pictures? So you're supposed to be able to play the first two... Oh, hell no. Already? You gonna teach me anything? Teach me, Sensei. I have to get out of here. Use the thing to look around. Okay. There's a door right there. Are these pictures getting closer? Okay, I'm about to say. I did, I looked around. You want me to do a full, cir full circle? Oh, they want me to exit. Okay, I get you. Oh, shit, bitch. So, yes, it's free to play. I don't know if this is the exact. I said, move the direction you want to walk. Was it this one or the other one? Did she run? Head toward the exit. Okay, we're going for this. What do you bitches want? No, don't be fucking hating on me because I'm more beautiful than you. That's what I'm seeing going on right now. I have to find a way out of here. Before I have a heart attack. Look around, move around. She can run. Awesome. The light at the end of this corridor. Maybe there's a way out that way. 
So yeah, it's kind of, it feels like a little slow because maybe my TV can't handle the 1080p. I can put the setting on 1080p, but they're chasing after me. I have to get out. Ooh. Hold down ZR on the run. So the character models look fucking awesome. But I don't know if it's just the demo, but the scenery doesn't really look too, too well right now. So there's a few chapters. Um, maybe I'll just try to play them, or at least I'll play the first one. We'll see what happens. Open the door. It won't open. It's being held shut by a powerful force. You would know, wouldn't you? So point the camera straight ahead. ZL. I'm hitting ZL. What the hell are you talking about? Switch the camera. Switch the oh my god, there's a lot of shit on there. He said ZL. I'm pushing. I'm pushing every button right now. Nothing's happening. Oh well. Maybe just tell me that's what to do when I get the camera. She doesn't look like she even has the camera. And there's something to touch on the actual touch screen. Looking like a fucking Barbie. You guys seen the the costumes for this game? Somebody just wet themselves, and it wasn't me. So yeah, I can't wait to see if this game actually stayed in sync. A lot of the time, Elgato's been having problems where it won't stay in sync. The audio won't stay in sync, and I, I really hate that. Now move down to turn back. What the fuck, man? Shit's really dark. I have no clue what the fuck she's really trying to do with size survive. Is she floating in the air? What the fuck, man? This game is so dark. Let me guess, it's the camera. Come on. CGI in this game, though, right? Is she in the water? Black Maiden, that's the name of the game, so why am I being surprised right now? I ain't surprised, I mean. Oh, beauty once again. Why do women hate so much? She has disappeared. Miu? Is that how you say her name, people? No one could have heard, no one could hear her cries for help as she was sealed in the shrine at the top of the mountain. I think that's what it said. The mountain is where the events of the story take place. We follow that. We follow the fates of three people: Yuri, Ren, and Miyu. Miyu. It's a terrifying tale of the supernatural. Fatal frame. Maiden of the Black Water. Maiden. Maiden Japan. Maiden. Japan. Slow clap. Some people don't get what I'm referencing, but okay. First drop, a vanishing trace, Yuri. See, among the residents of the villages at the foot of Mount Ikami, 
A uh, certain unique ability has been passed through the ages. This ability is known as shadow reading. Enables the user to view the shadow or trace of someone lost in despicable circumstances. This is unlike the the cycle met or hold up, psychometry practice elsewhere. I hope I said that right. Yuri accompanies Hisaka Hisaka Hisoka Hisoka. Hmm. A woman who possesses the shadow reading ability to abandon to an she okay, she basically accompanies this other chick into another abandoned inn on Mount Ikami. Sensing Yuri could find a time to become a talented become talented in sh shadow reading, Hizako takes a <laughs> cannot read this morning. Hizako takes her along on the on an assignment. She just drew her in pits of hell because he wanted to test her abilities, knowing she's not ready. And you know you're supposed to be able to sense bullshit before you should sense this fucking bullshit going on. I thought that I'd be scared of death. But I can't even cry. In the end, I am alone. Don't do it. Don't you fucking do it. I will end it all. Alone. Yuri? Huh? She was thinking about it. Somebody stopped her. What we're looking for should be in here. Ooh, look at that black dress. God damn. This is an excellent chance for you to take the lead. Here, take this. Ah. This is a camera obscura. It will let you see the unseen, including the clues that will help you find what we're here for. This is your opportunity, your first case. <laughs> I'm sure you'll do well. Let's start with a little practice. It works exactly like a normal camera. Give it a try. Just hold up the camera. Got him. Press X to enter What's photo wrong? mode. So you actually have to push the Just button to do like this. Just a normal camera. Just look through the viewfinder and press the shutter button. The camera obscura photographs the netherworld. A whole other world separate from our own. That world that we see through the lens is not in the See the world through the lens. So you can zoom in and out. Make sure awesome. not to draw too much interest from the things you see. If you aren't careful, you might be drawn into the netherworld yourself. What? Photographed by pressing what? Why? Well, I didn't get that. Use the plank up and down to find the third. Also, oh, there's more than one. Wait, hold down. Hold. I don't see anything else. What the fuck are you talking about? Vertically. I don't know what the fuck. Oh, vertically. I'm stupid. I get it. I was like, what the hell are you talking about? I was looking at the circle. Hold down ZR to lock on targets ZL and then push targets with. Okay. Lock on targets. Door. Where are the targets at, though? They don't really show. Them. There we go. Things around here seem to have changed. It wasn't exactly busted, but it never used to be like this. 
see. Feel free to take more pictures if you wish. So we do vertical. Oh, you have to wait. You can't just be taking them. You have to wait for the thing to gauge to fill up. Ready. Okay, I'm done. Take this. Post mortem photo or photograph. Photograph. Token. It will help lead you to what we're looking for. How do you know what we're looking for? Now don't panic, but be sure to stay on your guard. Go on and head inside. Okay, touch the pad. Display display the map. It's a broken looking map. Scroll on it. Okay, I think we're good. Let's see. I'm just gonna walk around anyway. Hi, bitch. I like that outfit though. I like both of their outfits. I'm not even gonna joke. Wish there was some hot Asian women around here. This is a postmortem photograph. It's not just a normal photograph that was taken to mourn the dead. It's why Ren sent us here. But it seems that this photo came from somewhere around here, and he wants us to see where we can find it. I really can't hear her because I have the TV a little bit too low, so I'm just trying to read. Is she okay? Wood sliding doors and other fixtures have piled up. It's a waterlogged and it's fallen apart. It probably would crumble at the touch. I like that you can investigate. Investigation. You should be watching. <laughs> I'm just looking to see if there's anything hiding. Like there might be film, ammo. What's this thing? Thick pieces of wood have been nailed to the window. Maybe they're they're here to protect against landslides. I pulled a muscle in my leg um, the other day. I was helping move some stuff, and I didn't do any stretches. And I pulled a muscle. And plus, it was wet outside. Let's see. I think this is where the service the service entrance should be. It's buried underneath the sea of rubble. Yeah, the slow, the turning is really slow. Let me see if there's an option. I don't see any options. There we go. Let's go back to display. Let's turn up the brightness. I'm just gonna turn it all the way up because my TV is really dark. Oh, it looks kind of weird though. Ugh. Whatever. Um, what was I supposed to be fixing? The camera sensitivity, okay. Search mode, movement speed while in photograph mode. Vertical movements in search mode. Let me see if she turns faster. Isn't that for that? I mean, your, your character turns faster than... Alright, whatever. Let me try this one more time. Let's put both of these up there. Um, we'll turn off the camera mode just a little bit, too. You know, we'll turn them all to the same, so I'm not struggling trying to do all this crap. Don't trip. Something's gonna happen here soon. It's been way too loud, loud, loud. Let's go get wet. This heavy scrap of wood at the end of the hallway. The water must have washed it all down here. There's a hole in the wall. I can see the next room over. It looks to be just as flooded. Can I go in here? Why the fuck are you guys coming in here alone? I mean, you guys are not alone, but... Man, the, uh, the costumes for these fools were really nice. I like the Zero Suit Samus one. Uh, I've seen the ones in Japan. Those ones are really lingerie-revealing type stuff, but... Hey, if it's an option, somebody's gonna like it. But they took it out for us in um, Europe. 
I think Europe didn't get it either. This is my first encounter. I liked it. They had a Zelda one, Princess Zelda. And then they had the Zero Suit Samus and they had a Peach one. Princess Peach one was the, was the ugliest one to me, I think. Okay, it's time to take this guy out. Zombie. Zomboo. How are we seeing these fools without even having on? We don't even have open. I guess my spirit, my my ability is awakened. Something's about to drop. Where's the camera? Can't the camera can't the camera see this shit? I'm just trying to get the, the photograph. Alright, whatever. Look at her. Don't wig out behind me. Wait. I can sense something. Now you can. Um, hold ZR to find the trail. It's called a trace. A shadow of the past. The token is showing you the way. Sure it is. <laughs> These traces can lead you to the right path. Let's follow that shadow. Where's it go? All the way down the hallway? But I want to go up here. <laughs> Come on, this way. Oh, you son of a bitch. Did I, did I fail because I didn't listen to you, teacher? Sensei? Senpai? So I'm just gonna hurry along. Pretty sure you guys like seeing her run anyway. Right, fellas? Pick up the item with ZR. Why is it ZR to pick it up? Hold down ZR to pick it up. Hmm. Interesting. An old dusty book that has been has been left in the hallway. Maybe someone dropped it. it says Mount Ikami's. Ikami's? Downfall? I don't want to read all this stuff, so you guys can take a look. Um just gonna kinda skim through it myself. If you wanna want if you wanna read it, just go back and pause it. Uh, that makes sense. I don't like reading too much in all these videos because I'm already struggling and it's just not my cup of tea. So yeah, blah 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 blah. Can I go anywhere else? Oh shit. That was a good scare fact that you put her right behind me. Do I get to play as the teacher? I'm pretty sure. She probably has the best abilities. X. Shadow. I, am I supposed to be taking pictures now? Echoes of the past tutorial. In places where the, tr where the traces of the past are very strong, you may be able to view echoes of the past. Photographing them will earn you photo points, which you can use to upgrade the cameras. The cameras? The fuck are you talking about, bro? Walk around the corner like this. Alright, whatever. I tried. She gonna duck by herself? Oh my god, I have to crawl myself? Aw, oh, shit, folks. I don't, I don't think I even pushed anything. B doesn't do anything. A doesn't crawl when you want it. A doesn't crawl when you want it to crawl, only when there's an, something obstructing your, your way. The door is locked. The Try using the camera obscura. The fuck? Physic or psychic photographs. Lens. You may notice it re reacting to the objects. They're not normal visual. The lock on the photograph could expose places or items they have connection with. Find the location for the photographs, and you may discover some clues, as, clues there as well. I do have it up in front of me. Press X to go into photo mode. And you want me to take a picture? See how the lock on it. Physics. Oh, it's back there. There's something in this photo. There's light coming out of the closet and there's a doll up on the top of the chest of the drawer. This might be where the key is. 
find the flesh shown where the photograph is is somewhere in this building. To view the photograph again, open the main menu and go to tokens and tab within the items report. Here, you see. go on ahead of me and look for the key to the Pretty building. sure. I'll wait for you. I'm pretty sure it was um, upstairs when I was trying to go up there and they didn't want me to go yet. What's this shit? Something's hanging up here? I see some feet. Did you see this shit? I just saw some feet hanging there. Did somebody else see that? Somebody was hanging right here. Where the fuck was it? I saw some feet, people. I don't know how this works. I know I saw some feet there. Alright, she's gonna leave me by myself, supposedly, but then she's gonna be right behind me when I get up here. Go ahead and run. Photo show this the photo shows an old Japanese style room. I should look for it in the old part of the inn. Yeah, what the fuck? I guess it's not that way. I don't get it. There was only a few ways to go. So they're saying I can't go up here. Let's try it one more time. Okay, maybe it was just behind this area over here. So there was a door right here. Wow. Oh my god, the slow door opening. Resident Evil style for the win. How do you use this shit? There's the shit that I was looking at. Why is it showing a little white thing on the side, like there's somebody in here. I seen that doll. You got the kid, the key on the red keychain. It might open that door, okay? Okay. Yeah, pretty simple. Not a big map. Oh shit, something's gonna happen. Oh my god. Was that bad? Fuck, I missed him. This little fucking doll about. Wait, I'm trying to look at this doll. What was the button again? Was it X? It was X, and then... That's pretty fucking freaky. Nothing? Okay, whatever. I know I saw some feet hanging here. Maybe that was the dude. He probably hung himself in here. Something's gotta happen. They're gonna just let me walk back over here. Let's see if we can see the feet. Let's see if we can see the feet again. I swear there was feet hanging there, people. I'm not making this shit up. Probably already messed up and then get my points, but that's what happens when you are a noob. You need a big group of people when you go and do shit like this. In this room. Take a look around. Locate the requested item. What is the requested item? Try searching with the camera obscura. How do you use this camera and scroll bar shit again? Invisible to the naked eye. Is it that right there? Hold on. Oh, okay. Phantom exposed. Let's see, the camera expert will react to its items that are normally hidden from the eyes of the living. You can bring those items back to the world by photographing the place where they take where they're taken from with the correct angle and position. Um hold down CR. Tilt the thing, push the R, and bring it back to this world. This is not the best, but... Hmm. No, 
not the best camera angling. Struggling here. Maybe it's... Fuck, I don't know. A little bit weird right now. Whatever, I pushed the fucking button on this bitch. I don't like how this moves in here. The controls got all weird. Okay. Okay, so hold down ZR, tilt the thing, and then press ZR to bring the item back to this world. ZR is, ZL is ZR. ZL is making me run. Maybe because I don't have the camera out. Yeah, move the fuck out the way. Oh, you have to take it at the correct angle. I get it now. So it's not always going to be the straightforward camera picture. You have to take it at the right angle. They said that. I just wasn't paying attention. This is what we came here for. Huh. We shouldn't stay here any longer than we need to. You're right. Let's head back before it gets dark. Okay. Of course she will walk out without me. So should I go back in there with that doll? Leave the abandoned uh, end, okay. I wanna go back over here with that doll. Pick out the camera. What is that? Scary. Scary, spooky games, baby. Gotta love them. But where's those feet at? Those feet were up here last time. See, something's right here. Oh, I see it. He closed the door, little fucking bastard. Little fucking bastard. Whatever, we're getting to the bottom of this. Wink, wink. <laughs> you think I didn't see that? All right, just gonna do. It. Searching for objects like we did just now might be easy, but searching for people is much more difficult. Okay. Psychometry allows you to see the psychic imprint as a shadow. Right. Never follow after the shadow of someone who has been spirited away. You might end up seeing something you wish you hadn't. Okay, I'm guessing he's in here, and I'm gonna go in anyway. <laughs> Never follow. What the fuck you think this is? Prepare to get scared, folks. Still want to take a picture of this thing. How does this work? They have to be right on the side of it. Something's gonna happen. That fool went in here and closed the door. Maybe I'm not close enough. No? Alright, whatever. I'm gonna check this door. He gets fucking freaked out. Why did the door close? It wasn't closed a minute ago. Oh shit. She scared the fuck out of me. Why did you come in here? <laughs> Fucking goofy ass woman. Alright, the camera angling is definitely weird in some of these areas. Like it's the the space is too confound. Confined. Shit, 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 shit. Alright, whatever. I saw the dude close the door, but maybe that was just a warning.
walking around like it's fucking normal. We didn't go up top. I might see Special something. Back. Oh, see, this game has boundary issues, man. Sorry if you hear my chair. My chair needs oil or some shit like that. Lots of cutscenes. Are the circles to deal the most, to deal them uh, to deal damage to them to capture the area the rectangle in the center of the screen is your area of attack you cannot you cannot take photos if you are out of film Let's see I am locked on this guy. Hard to take it. Okay, I don't see his little his circle. The camera's reloading. Cannot take a picture. Film is ready. Capture area. Okay, use this bubble walk. Sometimes fear of going to more fear of damage and kill ghosts. Shit. Cannot read this when I'm trying to stay on topic. After time, there is one. Target and shutters. Let's see, when five or more targets are in view, taking a photograph will knock back the ghost. The capture area will go red during the shutter stance. Keep adjusting your position to take. Okay, keep adjusting your position so that you have at least five targets, including the ghost and spirit fragments in the view and the trigger shutter. Okay, whatever. Fuck. I don't get it, man. What the hell are you looking at? I don't see any targets. This shit's moving weird as fuck. Seriously, this is moving weird as fuck. See, get five or more. So there's three more. This thing's moving weird for me. I'm not. see what they're talking about. Get five more targets in view. I only see one. Wow, I'm getting lucky if anything. Don't really see five. You guys get this? Because I don't. I didn't see five. I only saw three, if anything. Flashes are red as the ghost is attacking you. Take a fatal frame shot. You need to capture the ghost at mid attack. Okay. I mean, that was pretty close, but not that close. Okay. 
Okay, okay, okay. Use the... How do you banish the ghost? Fight the ghost when using the camera. I'm such a noob with this game. Like, I get what they're saying, but to see how to get them in all to view so I can get the actual biggest hit on them. So right now, this video is about 42 minutes. So I'm gonna see if this thing goes out of sync or not. It's gonna be a problem. Wow, why did you let me go through all that by myself? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have brought you here. Scary ass fucking girl. Look at her fucking nose. I am. Is this character from another game or no? Oh, she doesn't even sense her? Or is she seeing this chick? character. Oh yeah, I did see a guy. It's that dream again, he says. Um, Mr. Hojo? Hisoka came by a little while ago. Oh, Hisoka, what does she want? She found the photo book. She did? Yeah, here, take a look. Oh, shit. Shitaki. Dream. The question has played him for some time. So this is Ren. The the guy is the is the. Okay, I gotta see. I didn't do that well, but who would do that well in their first game? Um, I didn't really pay attention. So it took me 23 minutes without all the cutscenes. Not bad. Yeah, I'll probably go ahead and end this. What second drop me? Select which episode you want to play. Prologue first. I guess that was the first episode. That was the prologue, and that was the first two two things combined in one. 
Well, it makes sense. What am I talking about? Anyways, I'll go ahead. Ooh, costumes. Normal outfit. Oh, they actually show you what they are? Oh, they don't. That'd be too easy. We didn't get to play as her because she got trapped. We were playing as her, Yuri. Alright, so there's about five or six um, costumes there. That's pretty cool. And I'm just going to go ahead and back out. So anyways, like I said, people, this is the trial version. It's free to play. It's been out for like a week or two now. I should have played it when Halloween came because I think that's when it dropped. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and test this video because like I said, it was in 1080p, um, 60 frames per second, HD, Elgato HD 60. Um, I've never put this thing on 60 or on um, 1080p and recorded actual gameplay. I tried to live stream with 1080, but I don't think it really worked out, or at least I didn't. I probably didn't do something right. But anyways, let me know what you thought of the game, and if um, you would actually pick it up. Have you actually played it? Maybe I'm doing something wrong here. I don't, I don't mind criticism or um, help, helpful tips and stuff like that. It's definitely a spooky game for Nintendo, and Nintendo needs that, and I appreciate them for releasing this. Even though it's only a digital download right now, it's, I don't think this is actual retail. Um, but it seemed like it would be a fun game. I like how beautiful the characters look, not just because they're a cute, ja a cute Japanese Asian chick. Um, I think the scenery could, do, could use a little bit more detail, though, but I think this is how this game has always been. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and leave with that. Um, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like the channel, or like the video. So uh, Follow me on Twitter at GameDay2011. And until next time, folks, stay gaming. It's your boy Gamday. I'm out. Peace.